All right, hello everybody, this is Nick from the ArcadeHunters.com coming to you live once again in my good friend Dave's basement. Um, Dave was a bad boy over at the uh, Allentown Pin Fest where he got himself two new additions to the basement. So we're going to be checking out the brand new code for Ghostbusters. Um, the one that I shot previously was on version 1.2. Um, since then, they've updated it to version 1.4, and it seems that um, if you guys are watching um, some of the pinball videos that Jack Danger does over at Dead Flip when he was showing off the LE, I think that there's actually a version that they're working on now because there was a couple of things that were not in this. So um, 1.4 has a little bit some uh, some balance updates and stuff that weren't in the other one. Um, uh, what people were finding out with this game, and I'll explain it to Dave, is in the middle here, you know, it's Ghostbusters, you're always catching ghosts. So you go up to 20, 20 ghosts, you get the Tobin Spirit Guide, which is right here, and that's the random award, and it'll give you multiple awards for it. The number 40 is the, um, the negative reinforcement on ESP ability, which is collected over here at the scoop shot for the um, containment unit, and that's the video mode. 60 is the looping supers, which is up here on the ramp, and you want to keep shooting this, shooting the ramp as many times as you can. 80 is the PKE Frenzy, which is this um, little slide side ramp right here where it loops up and down, and you want to collect it. And as you're doing it, the whole entire play field gets brighter and brighter as you're collecting um, psychokinetic energy. And finally, the 100 award is the Mass Hysteria Multi Ball, where it flips inverts the um, the flippers. Now the problem that they had with the original code is uh, when you get into the multi-ball for the storage containment unit you lose all your ghosts and your whole job is when you're in the multi-ball is you're collecting the ghosts again along with collecting the jackpots. The problem was it was rewarding you all of the awards again so somebody was in storage containment mode got a hundred ghosts, and it kept giving him um, Mass Hysteria multi -ball, and it wouldn't stop. So he had like a two billion point game at the end of it. So now what they've done is they made it the way it's supposed to be where you just collect the ghosts and you're not going to get rewarded for it. Because they were saying that Mass Hysteria is not the wizard mode that is we're ready to believe you, where you have to get all of the different awards, so you have Back Off Man and the Spook Librarian from the Scoot Shot. Then you have the uh, everything that uh, corresponds with the Cedric Hotel is the main ramp, so that's uh, We've Got One, He Slime Me, and then the Ballroom where you capture Slimer. And then the other one over here has four of them, and this is the hardest one because there is obviously more to do. So you have uh, the first one, the Rick Moranis, Okay, Who Brought the Dog, Spook Central, where um, you'll actually see the Ghostbusters fall in, and then you have to save all four of them. And then Goes of the Gozerian and Stay Puft Marshmallow Man, I have not seen, but when you get to Stay Puft Marshmallow Man, that's when that little dude um, has a multicolor LED inside of him, and he'll actually um, change colors uh, regarding about how much uh, you're actually damaging him. So it's really cool that um, they have that in there. Um, one of the main big, big shots here is the Newton over here where you want to hit these, uh, hit the captive balls and try to stack all three of them and you get these awards so you have light super jackpot, the play field multiplier, um, add a ball when you're in multi ball and of course the light storage uh, facility. Um, it's not present in this version, it was present on the on the LE when they were filming it at the factory. Um, it's something that's confusing for um, novice players. It actually, when you lock a ball, it just says storage on it. And then it'll say storage again, and it'll show two traps that are smoking. But um, with the Ellie, it actually will say ball one lock because it's a physical ball lock. This is virtual, that we like to call it. So, Dave, step on up. I'm, Nick, I'm going to let you play the game, and I'm going to handle the camera duties. Excellent. Thank you very much. Okay. So, I'll try not to suck. This once again. Welcome to the Ghostbusters. This is not uh, Keith Elwin's videos. Uh, one of the other things that was added in number three, version 1.3, is the double Ooh, skill, skill shot. shot. So the left button will control the PKE, 
and the right does the blue ones, which is all the different corresponding shots on here. So I'm gonna go for the. Oh, I actually hit Stace on the set. I pissed them off. So since I did the regular skill shot, if I want to start anything, I gotta get Slimer. And yes, those are real slingshots. You know, some people are very upset they don't like the um, the magnetic slingshots that are going to be on the LEs and the premiums, but I'm only doing a shot just like everything else. No one has played it. There are So now we have a Slimer's list. The one thing with Slimer is every time you hit him, he slimes the playfield, so it says storage. So every time Slimer gets hit, he'll turn one of the inserts green, so the PKB thing is green. Wow. Yeah, those, uh... Those in lanes are very, very devious on this game. Okay, thank you. Uh oh, there's a bug. Zero bonus. I if I can get the scoop, I want to do this. Scoop Librarian and back off man, I'm a scientist that worth a lot of points. And we got it, we got Scoop Librarian. The music in this is very, very good. Congratulations to everybody at the, uh, that's working at Stern, that's, uh, doing all the music and the, the artwork from Zombie Eddie is absolutely beautiful. It's funny, when, um, this game came into, uh, the Pioneer's Lounge, um, one of the the bartenders came in and he saw the game for the first time and he goes, is this from the 80s? He actually thought it was an older game. He didn't think that they, you know, it's usually the older, even the original 80s. I'm pretty sure this game, you know, of how long it takes them to develop a pinball machine over at Stern. This had to have been in production uh, before they uh, started the new movie that's uh, going to be coming out in a few weeks. Actually, next week. Yeah, it's two weeks. Oh, I'm sorry, next, uh, in, uh, in April, on um, July, the end of July, I think it's like July 24th, uh, new Ghostbusters. Oh my god, that was awful. Well, you can see this game is super fast and challenging. I'm gonna go again. There's Dana. It's taken out by the Zul. Because the there is no Dana. Here. There's only Zul. It's hitting something up there. It's not going around. You're talking about all the way around the top? Yeah, it's supposed to go around. It's been hitting, it's hitting the same Wow! Right down the toilet. Everybody's talking about, oh, this game's too hard, and hopefully the guys ever at, uh, I screwed up on that. Hopefully they don't try to put the lightning bolt flippers on this game. I think no matter what, what version of Ghostbusters, if you are in the market for one of these, I think you're pretty good on either one, either one of the three. I know a lot of folks are waiting for the premium, like our good friend Chris Bucci is waiting on a premium. We got a couple of other... Uh, Steven over at Rock Fantasy has a premium uh, on board. I'm pretty sure all those uh, those LEs are all accounted for. You're up here. And who knows if it does good, we might see a, uh, a 
maybe they'll do a vault edition with the, uh, with the new camp. We never know. Oh, the scenes are like... That's not gonna get me a scene. And that's gonna go right down the toilet, and that was only bowl. That was bowl three. Bam! It just does that, it makes fun of you. Bam! So, folks, once again, I am Nick from the Arcade Hunters. This is version 1.4 of Ghostbusters Pro Edition. Uh, now that our good friend Dave has it, uh, hopefully, uh, We'll be uh, checking it out as it gets updated with um, new revisions and software. Hopefully, uh, maybe there's some extra um, sounds and stuff that they're going to add in from either of the two movies. It'll be very interesting to see. So once again, thank you for checking it out, and we'll talk to you again later. Take care.